Hello and welcome to the fourth episode of this Django course. In this episode, I'm going to talk about static files, that is images or CSS files or JavaScript files, how to include them and how does Django serve these files. So um, now you can, I, I just want to add a background image, for example, to this Jumbotron here to see how it works. So I'm going to go to my editor and this is the same kind of code that we have been writing except that I have added an image folder with just a couple of images in here. That's it. Nothing special. So first, how am I going to add a CSS file to, uh, to styling basically to my base.html? Normally, what you would do in HTML is you would have like a, a style sheet uh, link and also here you would put something like styles.css or some kind of path that leads here. But this is not how it works in Django. So the way it works is that you are going to define a static folder and static path so inside my settings.py, down below, you can find this right before the media URL and route that we talked about in the previous episode. I am going to define a directory for my static files. So this is the URL, that is uh, yourwebsite.com forward slash static forward slash, I don't know, CSS or some photos. But let's define some static files, static, let's see if uh, files, okay, directory. And there it is, thank you, Amazon. So we are going to define a static files directory and uh, directories, and that should be in the base directory, which is like here, inside a folder called static. So we do not have that folder yet, so I'm just going to create it static. So this in this folder, I'm going to put in my images, my CSS, or my JavaScript. So right inside, let's create another folder, let's call it CSS. And inside that, let's create another file, let's just call it styles.css. And now here, what we can do, let's just do something very simple like body, uh, color, red, and let's say it's important. Let's just to check if it works. So for now, let's see if I go back to my uh, web page and you can see it does not work in here. So I go back again and the reason it's not working is I need to insert it here. So what I sh should I do? Because it's a static file, I need to use this template tag, uh, curly braces and percentage signs, and mention load static to let Django know that I'm gonna load static in here. And what the static is going to be, is going to be, again, the same syntax, I'm going to use the word static, meaning this is belongs to static files. And where can you find it inside um, single quotes now? It is inside the static folder, inside a CSS folder, and it's called styles.css. So now let's check, yes, styles.css inside CSS inside static. So you can write, read it from right to left, and that will be correct. Okay. So this applies the changes, remember, to load the static and the ad press. Now, so let me just uh, run the server again. Okay, now if I go back and refresh, you see that the color is now in red. So the changes have applied. Now what about the images? Well, images, uh, the same way, I'm going to create inside the static folder another folder called it images just like that and inside well actually I had it so let me delete this so I'm just gonna move this images folder inside static okay so now I have 
these images folder inside my static file uh, folder. So how can I add the background to, for instance, um, where is the Jumbotron? Container, yeah, it should be in the home actually. Yes, yeah, so inside home, yeah, I have added this class hero. It was like this before, so I'm just gonna call it hero. So now I'm gonna add the background image to this hero inside the styles and let's just save everything here inside the styles instead of this i'm going to say the class of hero it's a dot hero referring to class is going to have a background image and the url of that background image is going to be where well this is the way you do it so go to static go to images and grab the bg background now we're gonna change the size as well, but let's just check how it works. Look, perfect. So it's been repeated, so I'm going to say no repeat to it. So let's just see, background, repeat, no repeat, and also for sizing, background, size, uh, cover. Okay, let's save this, go back, and look, great. So this is how you add images and uh, uh, also change the CSS or styling. And imagine, uh, sorry, not imagine, but uh, yeah, pay attention to the load static, where was that, that I used here. So whenever you want to use one of these static files, you need to load static before that. So if I want to add an image, for example, to about, uh, right here, as I have already, actually, I have loaded static, and I have done the image here, and the image is like this. I would cons uh, include static, static, and the path, which is images, forward slash phase two, or I don't know, phase three, whatever, dot jpg. And now if I go back and refresh, if I go to the about, you see this image appears here. All right, so that was about static files uh, in Django. Um, we are making a lot of progress. So see you in the next episode.